Yeah, it's a great view, but where are the dinosaurs? There should be Triceratops out there. Sometimes they're kind of hard to spot. Oh, yeah? Where'd you get those? Uh, these? Yeah, those. That, um, guy gave them to me, your boss, John Hammer, or whatever. He likes me. That was generous of him. Yeah. I see jungle and stuff, but no dinos. Just look around. You'll find them. Hey, there's a zoom thingy on here. We spare no expense. Hey, there's a dinosaur shaking that tree. Ah, forget it. Just some birds. Hey, there's a dinosaur shaking that tree. Ah, forget it. Just some birds. I see a... Oh, never mind. It's a rock. I see a rock. Maybe there's a dinosaur hiding behind that rock. Can we go down there and see the dinos up close? When I worked in San Diego, did I let you into the tiger enclosure? That was totally different. Besides, I was only like seven. Right. And you scared the daylights out of me. What's that yellow flower? It's kind of like Mom's Bird of Paradise, only, you know, healthy. Sounds like Heliconia. We imported them from the mainland to brighten up the place. You guys have more flowers here than dinosaurs. Yeah, but they're good-looking flowers, right? There's a pile of, like, brown stuff. Is that...? Probably. And that would tend to indicate a dinosaur in the area. I'm thinking more like ten. That is just... large. There's a car down there. Must be Hammond's visitors. He's got some hotshot paleontologists here to see the park. I bet they get to see some dinos up close. We should totally be down there. What's that little bunker building? Just a maintenance shed. 
For dinosaurs that need repairs? Yeah, sure. We like to keep them tuned up, you know. Does that shed have a bunch of broken lawnmowers in it, like our old shed? Those weren't broken. They were undergoing restoration. Wouldn't it be, like, educational if I stuck around here another day or two? You know, I think your mom might miss you a bit. Are you kidding me? She'd be, like, totally happy. Oh, come on. No, she wouldn't. Yeah, she would. There's a bunch of, like, dinosaur footprints around that plant. Our Triceratops are big fans of banana leaf. They're probably nearby. There's a bunch of, like, dinosaur footprints around that plant. Our Triceratops are big fans of banana leaf. They're probably nearby. How can we offend some of the nice dinosaurs? It's safer for them, and safer for us. Herbivores can be dangerous, too. This place would be way more fun without all the fences. <laughs> yeah, I don't think fun is quite the right word. Wait, wait, I definitely see one! Oh, he just ran away. Actually, it's a she. They're all female. So which way did she go? Hmm. Wait, wait, I definitely see one. Oh, he just ran away. Actually, it's a she. They're all female. So which way did she go? Hmm. The footprints go in the stream. Sure. The Triceratops went in for a dip. She must have come out somewhere. There's footprints coming out of the stream. You're on the right track. Okay, I see her. Wait, there's a bunch of them. Oh, awesome. They're fighting. I totally wanted to see this. Well, actually, it's more of a dominance display than a fight. You remember how patchy was when your mom got that new puppy? Lady Margaret's like that with the younger Triceratops. Seriously? Lady Margaret? Yep, that's what we call the Alpha. See those horns? They're more than three feet long. Good for fighting T-Rex, right? When do we get to see that? <laughs> that's not gonna happen. I'm busy enough without holding gladiator fights. Which reminds me, remember I said I've got a sick Triceratops to check on? I should get going. I'll drop you at the guest house. Really? Already? Well, it'll give you some time to pack your stuff. The boat leaves tonight, remember? I don't have any stuff. I practically just got here. Well, at least you got to see Triceratops fight. Actually, it was more like a dominance display. Smart ass. Come on, let's go. Let's hope for clear skies tonight. No fun on that boat when the waves are rough.